thing to do Just to stand and look at you That's amore Viva Las Vegas Viva Las Vegas Six, the channel dedicated to the local Las Vegas music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're continuing our series on the history of music in Las Vegas. If you missed any of the previous videos, I'll put a link in the description. This time, we're hitting the 70s, so break out your bell bottoms, baby! <laughs> If you're enjoying the content Room 6 is putting up, please make sure you subscribe down there and hit the bell so you don't miss an episode. While you're at it, feel free to like and share, and uh, yeah, let's go. Still flying high from the entertainment wonderland that was Vegas in the 60s, the music scene on the strip was still going strong, with a plethora of top 40 chart toppers being lured to town, including the iconic Rat Pack, the Supremes, and Tom Jones. What's new, pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa. By 1976, incredibly talented and famous acts like Elvis Presley were closing their shows, however, and the entire nature of the casinos was changing to more of a theme park for middle America, as corporations slowly took over the strip properties and pushed the mob out. Remember the movie Casino Kids? Even though organized crime was moving out of the picture, Las Vegas was earning itself a reputation for excess. To quote songwriters like Graham Parson, Every time I hit your Crystal City, you know you're gonna make a wreck out of me. The Flying Burrito Brothers would go on to sing, This old town is filled with sin, it'll swallow you in. And truer words have never been written. With the shine of Las Vegas starting to wear off, many big name acts would only play Vegas once in a while and for very limited engagements. While this generated immense buzz for these one-off gigs, it definitely trashed the city's image a musical mecca and a safe place for musicians to plant their roots. Next time, we'll take a look at how things in the 80s went from bad to worse, and then a little better. See you then. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and that we'll see you in the next video in the series. In the meantime, if you want to click a link in the description to support the channel, that'd be great. If you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. And if you'd like to subscribe to the channel, please click down here and don't forget to ring the bell to so be notified when new videos get posted. Remember to be amazing and we'll see you next time in room six.